welcome back to the other man campaign where we are conquering and we are destroying the world really we are destroying the world I mean no one is trying to stop us to destroy the world uh, our next victim in fact is going to be our good friends up here of of uh, Mexico or Mexico and do I think anyone's gonna try to stop me America nah America's just gonna let me roll over and destroy them because that's apparently what they're doing. They're just letting me roll over and destroy most of their friends. And as you guys last know, we had like a little rebellion spark. And I thought it was because of, you know, we actually have little legit rebellions in my country. But it, most likely what it was was that it was actually the Italians. They were having major difficulties. And then the events fired when I took over. So it wasn't actually because they actually had big gigantic rebellions. It's just because they had to fire when I was there. So, yeah. Anyways, though, we have our armies right here on the coastline waiting to go invade the uh, Jap Japanese coast, I guess. Do we have, by the way, do we have uh, what I want yet? <gasps> yes! Oh, yeah, Japan's going to so get slaughtered. Japan, you don't even know how, you know, bad your situation is until you start realizing my gas attack capabilities. Oh, gosh. Uh, German minor cores removed due to the German unification minor cores state to become rudiment. Does that mean they, did they try to unite and form a Germany again? I would kill them if they did that. Especially considering that would be one of the weirdest looking Germanys ever. That I mean, that would be like, this little plot of land, this little plot of land, this little plot of land, that little plot of land, and then that little plot of land. It would be really cute to see them all, like, try to organize, but then what I would do is I would just take over all of them and make, and make that into my own little puppet. So... It's a good thing they didn't do that. <laughs> I guess the short answer is, it's a good thing they did not do that. Okay. Annexation. Now I can allow annexation. Alright, Japan. We've been bros forever, but I think our bro ship is finally ended. Bye-bye. Okay. And now with Mex Mexico. Mexico, you have no allies. So this is going to be insanely quick. If you want to join in Romania, you can. I mean, I'm not really requiring it. Let's see, everyone, go in, go in, go in. There we go. Oh, man. This should be a really good conquest. Hey, Cuba, Cuba, you guys want to join in too. Because, why? Because I said so. And that's good enough reason. Okay, you guys, go make sure those pretender rebels are going to do some stuff that won't destroy my empire. So I literally almost have the entire world underneath my grasp. And I really don't want to deal with rebels. Let's see, Mex Mexico. I'm pretty sure does not have the, the gas attack defense capabilities. So, um, will they be much of a threat to us? Probably not. They're not going to be able to fight us efficiently. I think they're actually charging us in one of the regions. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see how they do. We, do we have gas attacks? Yes, we do. Oh my goodness, this is a terrible thing. They only have five in total, but then it's like negative. They have negative one because the dug-in factor in us won us a lot. And then we have, look at all these great rolls. Oh my goodness. You guys, we're going to kill so many of you guys before we even have to really consider you guys a threat. That's the sad part is, is that I won't even, I don't believe I even have to send in my troops to go clean that up. Because literally I think they're going to kill each other. Yeah. It's 37. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, that... Uh, the battle, the battle of Tapa. Oh, what is that? Uh, Tabla Kula. Bad battle. That was a slaughter. Not even joking. The Mexicans just got slaughtered. They weren't even. It wasn't even a fight. It was just a slaughter, man. I mean, oh. I feel like I said there is a sense of morality here that this is. I do like good fights. I mean, I don't like being the total bully all the time. I do like good fights. I like when people, like, you know, actually, you know, fight for their full, true freedom. But, I mean, this is just they don't even have a chance to beat me. They really don't. Uh, but I guess we just have to continue on because the quest for world safety and world peace requires us to destroy all the other threatening nations of the world. Uh, yes. That's how I'm justifying it. Oh my goodness. Yeah, Mexico lost all of its power. In just the beginning moves. It lost most of its men. 
Oh my goodness. Moving right there. Let's see. Oh my goodness. Truly is. Truly is. This is truly a, a world. A battle that will not be. I mean, they, they did. The good thing about them, though, is that they did destroy this army right here. But, I mean, they lost so many men. This was like fighting China right now. I mean, literally, they had literally no chance. And now they're going to kill off all the soldiers right there. Oh, my goodness. I mean, wow. The amount of death in that whole entire battle scene, guys. Wow. Oh, man. Okay. But... Let's just move on. I'm going to stop thinking about it because I think I'm going to get myself really down if I start thinking about all the people that just... Yeah, okay. I think they're, I think they're really trying to... I think what they're trying to do is they're trying to prevent the, the fallen comrade to destroy that army. They might actually win, to tell you the truth. But, yeah, one. But I'm actually sending in a decent-sized army. Oh man, this is like last samurai kind of stuff. Even though they might destroy that one little bit of army, there's still the other army to deal with. And, oh my goodness, okay. Let's go crush the last little bits of their army. Before they have really, oh my goodness. Go combine with these guys. You guys will be secret kind of protectors with these guys. Go conquer Mexico City before we do anything. That way we have Mexico City underneath our grasp. Go destroy these guys. All right, yeah. Ah, oh, man, yeah. You guys go down there. All right, you guys go right up here. Hmm, almost done, almost done. The mission to Japan. It'll finish, don't worry, people, it will finish. Oh, my goodness. The death, man, the death. Excelente, I guess. All right, oil. Uh, participation, excellent. Okay. Go right here. Go destroy the last little bits of their army. Cause I'm pretty sure this is the last little bits of their army. Okay. And from there, destroy that, destroy that. Let's see. Ah, oh, man. Let's see. Oh, war declared! Yay, war that is not involving me! That is nice! That is interesting to hear about, actually. War that is not me. Let's see. Let's go up here. Mexico is... Mexico's about defeated. I'm gonna say that. It's... I believe the army is basically now done for. Alright, let's see. Do I have my Casas Belay yet? No, I still am 63% not there. Uh, yeah, we'll definitely finish up conquering the rest of Mexico by the time the Contra Spelli comes around. The last little remnants of the troops are now all dead. Uh, and now we're just sieging up the rest of the land. Okay, let's see. There's a couple good armies right over here. Let's go start destroying some of them. Oh, my goodness. 3k versus 33, yeah. Yep, Mexico is now done for. No more men, no more nothing. There's nothing they can do to stop me. Well, just time to just conquer them quickly and painlessly. Go right here. Go right there. Let's see. Do, 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 do. Uh, yes. Clearly and painstakingly, I will destroy these guys. Let's see. You guys are creating more men. You guys are going to Mexico. I'm going to go finish off this last little creating a men place. Because I hate places that create more men. Because you make this war just longer. Let's go see you guys go up here. Let's see you guys conquest all this. Once you guys are done conquesting, I think what I'm gonna go do is go send you guys to Mexico City, go finish out the last little bits of men. Yeah. Alright, you guys go right here. No, go right there, then go right there. Alright, you guys go right here. Go directly to the border, everyone. Directly to the border. Whatever, United States, if you guys hate me, you guys aren't gonna fight me. So what's the point? Of you guys is threats of you guys hate me you may hate me but you're not gonna try anything let's be real here all right and the last little bits of Mexico's army finally dissipates with that we should try again yes we have the most money in the world it's our duty to try to tame the world okay let's see you guys are still not building enough of an army I'm kind of getting annoyed by that let's see you guys right here we've officially 
conquer the rest of the land. Okay, then let's go right here. Move in. Move in right there. Yep, Mexico, gone. Mexico, gone. No more. No more. Mission to Japan. Japan's really stopping us from trying to do stuff. And Lafayette went bankrupt. I didn't like that. Okay, you guys go there next after you've done the battling. Done the battling. Let's see, get research. Let's go right here. Let's see, and then you guys are probably almost done. 99, there we go. There we go. You guys go up here. Right. Let's go see. Yes. Everyone's. Okay. Right. So you guys are gonna go in there. So, so you guys are gonna try to see down there. Yeah. Well, basically. Right there. You guys go right there. Yeah. We're basically just watching the end of the Mexican army. Ah, <laughs> oh, man. And let's see, how close are we to our cause it's been like 97, alright. I'm 97% there, so let's start loading up some of our armies onto ships. Alright, let's see. We need a big army for this. Because the initial army needs to be really powerful enough to destroy Japanese to the point where they won't be able to fight me. Let's see, farming output, whatever. We don't really need to care about farming output because we already have like literally I think I could probably get, get I think I could probably take down the five percent of all my territory and I could probably get a lot from that. Okay, let's see. You guys go right here. Let's see. Oh wait, you guys are created troops. Never mind. You guys go back there because you guys are gonna be need to be get created. Okay, you guys go right here. You guys load up on here. You guys load up on here. Go right here. Go right here. These two armies together should make a very powerful army. Even the Japanese troops that they do have should not be able to destroy 110 brigades. So let's go right here. Alright, Japan, you're not even ready for it. Man, you poor souls. Japan, good knowing you. Bye bye, though. Romania joined in, that's good. All you guys. I don't really want you guys to combine. Let's see. Send this man right there. See, do you have the troops? Send these guys right there. And let's go see the third one. Alright. You guys have troops? Alright. Let's go see. Alright. It's the 21. I need the 21. Yeah, you guys. You guys go to the Seto Islands and make sure you guys can block any new troops from coming onto the island. Well, I'll make sure I can take over Japan very slowly. So that I make sure I don't have to rush it. Okay. So the last thing we need to do is just do this all sloppy-like. Yeah. Let's go do that. Alright. Back over here in Mexico. Go right here. Then you guys go down here. You guys go down here. And then go start sieging that. Yeah. Okay. Armenia collapsed. Oh no. Horrid. Absolutely horrid research points a little bit. Boosted though. Through the whole ability. Right. You guys are going to be fine for a little bit. I'm looking at the sieges to make sure they all finish up on time. Let's see. My men landing. Alright. We got all this blocked up so they can't get out. They can't get their soldiers out. Those 9k are going to die. That way I can also assess their powers. Um... Let's go see. Let's go see. Go send the 67 back. We're going to go pick up this army right here because that's pretty sure that's just a regular army. Let's see. I think we just finished some of our sieges back over here. So I'm going to go get that done with. Yep. Go right here. Let's see. 94 Komoto. That's pretty sure that's Japanese. So about to finish up there. Yeah. Let's see. You guys go right here. You guys go right there. Okay. Then from here. Yeah, look at that. Let's go see. You guys go right here. You guys go get that. You guys go land your troops right over there. Let's go see. Yeah, Japan's basically being defeated. Very, very quickly. Just like the others. One of the last superpowers in the world. Just demolished. Alright, and let's go see. Let's go conquer this last little bit right here. Next, go back. Oh, wait, I'm actually at war with all these people. Yes! Okay, that actually makes this kind of interesting. So, 
That means I actually do need some of you guys' help. Okay. Call you guys into there. Let's see. So, Vakia, I need you guys. Go into all my wars. Uh, Lithuania, I need you guys. Go into all my wars. If Stone, Latvia, this nation, I mean. Latvia. You guys come into all my wars. Alright. So, yeah, now we. This actually could be a decent sized war. The last war for Japan. Oh, wow. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> Literally have a soldier right there. Oh, wow. That's just. Wow, that, that just makes me feel like such a mean person. Literally, soldiers right there. I was like, they might actually have a chance. No. Let's see. Move in right there. Move in right there. Let's see. Mexico. Still not ready to surrender. I don't know why. I think by now they'd want to surrender. We have literally all the land. Let's see. Japan. Japan's front. Let's see how they're doing. Do we finish up some of our sieges? Yes, we can actually start invading some of the mainland. I think very casually we can. I don't, like I said, they mostly have just Japanese troops. So this is going to be interesting to see how they fight. See all of our troops. Oh my goodness, we're slaughtering them, aren't we? Yep, they don't have gas attacks. They do not have gas attacks and they're going to get slaughtered. Okay, let's go pick up more men. Um, you guys right here. I believe you guys are onto recruitment. Yes, you guys are actually. So, actually I need you guys to go right here. Go pick up these men. Then go send them to go fight this war. I'm pretty sure what we're going to do is just basically going to kill them just because of our outnumbering. Oh man, this is... Alright, Mexico, finally going to give up. Thank you. That ends that war. Okay. Ottoman Mexico, by the way, everyone. Woohoo! Okay. Uh, go crush... Go get... Go hunt down rebels. Go crush those guys. Um, You guys are really mobilized. You know what? Stay mobilized. I want you guys to go help me go take over the Ch the Chinese. I mean, Japanese. You guys, over here, Philippines. You guys go help me, too. Alright, and then... Who else could probably help me? Anyone over here have an actual army? Uh, you guys kind of have an army. So, hey, you guys, go help me. Alright, and let's see. You guys split up into two armies. One go right here, the other one go right there. I'm going to have you guys become conquerors. We need to conquest all of this. That way we finally have all that in our possession and look pretty nice. Probably should go also conquest Afghanistan too. But as you guys can see, the massive swarms of men are coming. I actually have my own army over here. What am I doing? Okay. Let's go, um, go right here. Go right here. Hey, Afghanistan. There we go, and then we go back to over here in Japan, where of course we're slaughtering all their armies without even really giving, we're not even really trying to be honest, like the army's just being slaughtered at very fast rates, I mean literally just fast rates, oh man, yeah, yeah now, now we're definitely starting to win because they just, ooh we actually, they might actually win that battle right there, ooh. So it might actually get exciting. Oh man, we might actually not defeat all the army in one go, which is good. Okay, get on the boats. You guys go this way. You guys go right here. You guys go pick up this army right over here. Hey, and you guys divide up into two. Go send half of the army, because I'm not sure which straight it is. Just go send half the armies over there, just in case. Alright, there we go. This army's about to die. Oh man, I hope I didn't destroy all the Japanese troops already, that'd be really sad, like seriously sad, okay, let's see, we got more 57 more men, let's see, and most, just go start crushing through all that, there we go, I think we just defeated the rest of their, like mobilized divisions, yeah. Oh man, 52 versus 17, that is a tight battle right there. Let's see, you guys get on the boats. Um, Actually, I'm probably going to have to have you guys go right there. You guys get on the boats, let's see, you guys almost done. Let's see, is there anyone else that needs to be right here? Oh man, two, two units. Alright, you guys go right here. Oh man, yeah, Japan's doing a pretty... Japan's really fighting for their country, that's for sure. 
I think we've... Oh, well, thank you guys for watching. Hope that the next episode of Us Fighting Japan will go much more smoothly. Are they able to conquer these islands? No, they aren't. So I want to thank you guys for watching. See you guys next time.